unfortunately, we are paying a big price for it. And our, our private media cannot fill that gap. Well, that's it's enough. The American message, do you think what Hollywood and the news puts out is an American message? What, they'll doll up tyranny with some American flags and a model? You are losing the info war, Hillary. So they have George Soros and all the usual suspects launching satellites that will beam stuff in to wherever they want and pushing for censorship here of speech they don't like. You know, they're the biggest supporters of free speech. Of course, they're against yours, though. Uh, and 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 they're 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 trying to launch all these quote alternative sites. They're all going to fall on their faces. Look, if the information on this show ends up getting out to people in a big way, and it's starting to happen, there's no way they're going to get away with this stuff, folks. It's just that it's so horrible what we're saying. I don't blame people not wanting to admit it. A scientifically designed technocracy, a dehumanizing grid. A fourth Georgia hospital is closed due to Obamacare payment cuts. Health law impact has only begun. These are decadent elites is what they are. So sick. No one in Jimmy Kimmel's audience has been able to sign up for Obamacare when he asked them. That's because no one is able to sign up for it. It's all a hoax. The idiots that think they've signed up for it just haven't gotten the word yet. And we've got James O'Keefe uh, has exposed Project Veritas, another scheme to, quote, turn Texas blue through fraud. I mean, it's just, it's just incredible. And then you're like, well, I thought the Republicans are bad, too. Yeah, but they're, they're making their move with the Democrats. They don't even want two parties that they control. They want one party. So there's no way to get out of this stuff. It's just a gang of crooks. They don't need to produce things. They need to just take over, and then they run everything. You don't need to become Henry Ford to be a major industrialist. You should get into government and shut down your competition and give yourself all the business. Makes me sick. It's slavery is what it is. Steve in Chicago, you're on the air. Go ahead. Yes, sir. Uh First of all, a uh, little bumper music. I recommend It's Good News Week by Hedgehoppers Anonymous, an RAF dive bomber combo. You know, they would say, um, it's good news week. Someone's got to drop some bear, uh, uh, a bomb somewhere and contaminate the atmosphere. I'm not going to go into it. The other one, I think, um, what's the meaning of this song? It's a strange, strange world we live in, Master Jack. Well, they... Uh, you, you you take a current ribbon from out of the sky and taught me how to use it as the years go by uh, to make up all your problems and make them seem uh, people believe and then to sell them in the people in the street. And it goes on. But the reason why I called up, you were talking about Julia Timoshenko. Whatever happened to her that was uh, in the Ukraine, they imprisoned her. Uh, I guess the KGB did. They wouldn't give her medical care. And uh, she was supposed to go to Germany, and you never hear about it. She was like the president of Ukraine. I know. They just snatch people off the street now all over Europe. You name it. By the way, McGruff, you just called in under the gnome to plume Steve. McGruff, the crime dog, gets 16 years for having 100, no, excuse me, 1,000 pot plants and a grenade launcher. Now, I know you're the older McGruff, the original McGruff sound guy. Uh, do you know the new McGruff guy this happened to? Uh, no, not personally. No. What, another thing you, you pointed, about, uh, pointed out about the European Union, the idea, the concept really came from a Pierre Du Bois. And he was a Norman who lived from uh, 1250 to 1312. And he was, uh, um, well, he proposed that all the Christian nations of the world unite, uh, the Western European, and that the uh, French uh, uh, king be, be the leader of it. So that, that was uh, one of the forerunners. Um, to, to create a, a, a crusade against the uh, uh, the Holy Land, you know, because it was taken. Well, over it is by true. The Vatican is a signature to the European Union uh, first event in '57 in the Treaty of Rome uh, when they actually set it up. Of course, they, they didn't admit the EU existed until about 1999. They talk to the public like they're children. I mean, it is just so frustrating to see a group of the public's about like lobotomized children that have had a high dosage of PCP. Uh, listen, McGruff, in the voice of McGruff, will you tell me that um, I want you to 
talk like Darth Vader, but in the voice of McGruff, I want you to say, we will end this destructive conflict. I want you to say, we will end this destructive conflict and bring order to the galaxy. Uh, we will end this destructive uh, conflict and, and bring an end to it. No, no, no. We will end this destructive conflict. I mean, let me actually try to say it. We will end this constructive conflict and bring order to the galaxy. And bring order to the galaxy. And you don't want you to say it in a British accent. When you say it in McGruff, I want you to say, this is McGruff. Yeah. Go ahead and say, we, okay. go ahead and say it. McGruff. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we'll, we'll bring this uh, disorder to an end. That, uh, we'll create a new, a new world, and it'll be a utopianistic world. <laughs> Oh, my gosh. And what is a utopianistic world, McGruff? we got 20 seconds. Well, that was the king of Bohemia, George of uh, Pody Brady. He, uh, he also uh, uh, hypothesized as an anti-papist movement. Uh, he sent a, an emissary by the name of Leo Ro Rosemittal uh, out to the European <laughs> courts. <laughs> with, with it. McGruff, i got to go. Silver has always been nature's very own antibiotic, and only one system allows you to generate an endless supply of natural silver solutions, silverlungs.com. You'll find no wild claims or pseudoscience, just a lifetime of nano-sized pure silver solutions. The Silver Lungs Generator allows you to make your own, so stop paying for silver solutions. The unique lung delivery system targets respiratory infections where other silver solutions simply cannot reach. See the Silver Lungs Generator and Lung Delivery System at silverlungs.com. That's silverlungs.com. A lot of people's lives and bodies are out of balance. AlkaVision Plasma pH Drops optimize pH level and get rid of harmful waste and acid. Just a few drops in water restores vibrance and energy and gets you back in balance. Now order two bottles and get $10 off your order. Sign up for monthly auto shipping and save 25%. Call 800-518-7615 or visit alkavision.com. Alkalize your body. Supercharge your health at alkavision.com. A 30-day GMO-free emergency food supply for only $99 at 30dayfoodsupply.com. You can purchase Oregon Trail Foods' one-month supply of high-quality, nutritious, and healthy emergency meals. For less than $100, these vegetarian meals are naturally high in fiber, carbs, and protein, and they're packed with oxygen absorbers in Mylar pouches. They're completely free of any artificial flavors and colorings, have a 20-year shelf life, and take up to 70% less space than number 10 cans. They even offer a gluten free option. Oregon Trail Foods and 30dayfoodsupply.com keep prices low by buying directly from the producers in Oregon and then passing the savings to you. Purchase a 30-day 90-serving emergency food supply for only $99 this month and $10 ships your entire order. Visit the website at 30dayfoodsupply.com or call 541-229-0010. That's 30dayfoodsupply.com where they make preparedness affordable. 30dayfoodsupply.com. Great news, pure water lovers. BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com has a special discount offer for all GCN listeners. You can't do better than a Big Berkey for economy. For only 1.7 cents a gallon, a single set of filters can last for 5 to 10 years. There's none better than a Big Berkey for emergency preparedness as a backup water source. And you just can't beat a Big Berkey to remove dangerous chlorine, all types of fluoride, pathogenic bacteria, cysts, parasites, and unhealthy bodies products from municipal water. Berkey water filter systems are even powerful enough to purify stagnant pond water. For the gold standard in water filters, get a Big Berkey at BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com. And all GCN listeners get 5% off all ceramic filter systems. For details, call 1-877-99-BERKEY. That's 877-99-BERKEY. Big Berkey water filters for the love of clean water. Here's John Bounds report we're premiering on air right now dealing with the Bill of Rights and Constitution. How informed is the public? I'm down here on the campus of the University of Texas in Austin. We are asking students whether or not they know their Bill of Rights. Can either of you name any of the Bill of Rights? Um, most of them. Not under pressure. Not under pressure. Do you think it might be important to know the Bill of Rights? Yeah. Why? These are the first ten amendments to the Constitution. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know the first one? 
Um, the, the most important reason why you need to learn them is because your generation may see the last of them. So it's really important that you know what your rights are so that you can do something to hold on to them. All right. Thank Will you. you do that for me? Yeah. yeah. Sir, can you name me the Bill of Rights? Not today. Sorry. He's too Not cool, today. man. That guy's so trendy. I guess America can wait. Ma'am, can you name me the Bill of Rights? These people are totally helpless. The Bill of Rights. Uh, what the right to uh, I'm not even going to say it. <laughs> I'm going stupid. This is why the uh, elites take The right to down. a fair, fair and speedy trial. Wow, you he must got have one. Been in court recently. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I have experience with that one. Ma'am, can you name any of the Bill of Rights? No, these are all too cool. Trendy, They're all though. TV heads. No. Uh, the right to bear arms. The right to bear arms? What? Gentlemen, uh, Bill of Rights, name any of them? Nothing. Go Canada. Go Canada. Okay. They're all ultra uh, cool. Do you know your Bill of Rights? I'm talking to a mannequin. Ma'am, Bill of Rights? Oh, no. Okay. The Bill of Rights? Yeah. <laughs> the American Bill of Rights? No. Shame on you. <laughs> no. Yeah. Okay, well, I'll give you one. Which one? One through ten. Just pick one. Mm, five. Five. You have the right to not say anything if you've been incriminated, to zip it until you get a lawyer. Okay. Then still do that. Remember, yeah. remember that. It may come in handy. Who knows? It could come in handy in the next 20 minutes. Okay. All right. Number one, freedom of the press. TV speech, killed everybody. These people aren't even people. They, they... Beautiful thing. Yeah, it is. It's a beautiful thing being an American. The life force is gone. Rights. They're not even people. Yeah. Well, shame on us for not knowing them, right? You yeah, is right. Okay, go, go, go revisit. The thing is, they're the so rights. nice, though. They're so ready to Bill be destroyed. Name any of the Bill of Rights? I have to go to class. Sorry. Yeah, go to right. class. Bill of Rights. I really want to stop and talk to you, but I have to go to class right here. Yes, very trendy. Can you guys name any of the uh, Bill of Rights? Uh, you ever heard of those? Yes, of course. Uh, lo love Infowars, by the way. Oh, thank you. Um, First is the freedom to speech, um, includes uh, freedom of religion. Uh, you also have the uh, the freedom against unlawful searches and seizures. Tenth Amendment to uh, the all rights not allotted to uh, the federal government should be allowed uh, the states. Reserved to the states or to the people, the states respectively. Have the power to, to legislate Good job, their own. one of our listeners. Well, whoever's paying for your education, I salute them. I am a true organic man. I'm an endangered species. Can you name any of the uh, Bill of Rights? Um, can you remind me what the Bill of Rights is? I really don't think it's an issue for the government to have information, but at the same time, you know, is... Oh, my gosh. You know, well, how, how, how about this? He thinks the government's inside have his... the right like, like The government's like him, have a the nice government guy. have my information. I have a Fourth Amendment. Okay? Yes, right. I, I have I have I have right to privacy, and whether or not you don't care doesn't matter to me. That's right, Personally, dumbass. I don't want that in my life, and that's my right. Now just go ahead and punch him in the citizen. nose. So they have no <laughs> right to take that away. Do you want to punch him in the nose like I do? I mean, I can't argue with that. <laughs> I mean, that's the Bill of Rights, America. The Bill of Rights. Can you name any of them? Look at these are you, sloths. Are you aware that you're paying for a college education? The most slothful people are downtown when I drive through there. Be very aware, ladies and gentlemen. This next generation coming down the pike doesn't really know their Bill of Rights. That means when it comes time to defend this country or defend themselves, they have no idea what to do. There'll be more on the Nightly News tonight, 7 o'clock Central, PrisonPlanet.tv. If you're watching this transmission, you are the resistance. Today. The facts are in. The studies are legion. Sodium fluoride and other toxic members of the fluoride family are devastating the health and cognitive ability of the American people. So why are the social engineers adding it to the water? Simple. Dumb down the